Hey there friends, in today's quick CapCut tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add video effects to your clips. It's a super simple process, let's jump into it. Now I'm using the desktop version of CapCut, but this is gonna be fairly similar if you're using your mobile device. Now remember, we're using the free version of CapCut today, so our features are gonna be a little limited. You can always upgrade to Pro over here to get a lot more. So let's go ahead and we're gonna hover over a video clip that we want. In fact, I'll go ahead and click on it like this. As you can see, it's just a quick little shot of a coffee maker. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna come up here and I'm gonna click on effects. Now this is gonna bring up some really, really cool options. You can actually click on trending, nightclub, lens. There's a lot of different filters that you can throw on this so that you're just looking at things that might work for you. Let's click on trending at this point. Now, as you can see on these effects, there's all sorts of interesting ones. If you just hover your cursor over, you get a little preview. You can see some sparkles there, some snow up here little blurred love right here with some hearts. Now remember, anytime you see this little purple diamond up in the top left corner, that's gonna indicate that these are only available for the pro version of CapCut, which you have to subscribe to. In this instance, let's go ahead and just pull a couple of free versions. Here's a little tree shade, it looks like. Let me go ahead and click on this. And once I click on it, you can actually get a little preview over here on our video. So as you can see, there's like some lighting effects that happen over here. Let's try sunset and see what happens with that. As you can see, it lens flares up here in the top corner. What else can we do? Let's look at, this is a kind of a cool one. It adds just kind of a, almost a techno feature like that. Again, super cool little extra that you can add just to bring some interesting dynamics to your video. So let's say we like this one. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over here. I'm just gonna bring it down on top of the area for the clip that I want it to be used for. Now here's the cool part is I can actually stretch this out so it's over the entire clip, or maybe even a couple of clips. I can reduce it down so it only happens in the very beginning. Again, you can kind of play around with this and the time length based off of what you want the clip to do. So again, let's go to the beginning of the clip. Let's hit the space bar here. You can see it in action again. So again, kind of a cool little feature. Just drag and drop these effects directly on top of the clips where you want them. And again, just makes your video a little more interesting to watch. Friends, I hope this has helped. Again, if this has, hit that thumbs up button. Stay tuned, we're gonna actually do a ton of these little short tutorial videos to help your editing journey in CapCut become just a little bit easier. Stay tuned, subscribe, and we'll see you again on the next one.